We are living in a mobile world. We eat, walk, work and even sleep with our mobile devices. Mobile banking services save us tons of queuing time and effort to get simple transactions done. If mobile banking could provide better service and convenience to consumers. Why are the seniors not using it? Elderly have relatively bad memories, thus they cannot remember their passwords. Especially for a typical six-digit password. Elderly forgot to bring along their token either. Although nowadays, mobile banking tokens are very compact, many people, even young ones, still forgot to bring them along. Mobile app is complicated, mobile banking apps are among the most complicated ones. Most of the elderly could not figure out how to operate even very simple procedure. Last but not least, elderly are the ones who concern about security the most. When I see the counter staffs, I feel more safe in transferring money. This is a typical stereotype from elderly. What would happen when elderly do not want to use mobile banking? Long queue outside the banks appears. We cannot change consumer behavior overnight, therefore we start with management and the branch first. Firstly, we would introduce IBIC an indoor positioning system to auto-detects of senior entering the branch and sends a greeting message. Retail managers will also be alerted on the guest's arrival. For repeated customers, the mobile app will ask what services or transaction the senior would like to perform. Subsequently, the app verifies the identity of the customer using our proprietary biometric authentication suite. This include facial recognition, voice recognition, picture recalls, etc. Combining with our indoor tracking solution, it would create a highly secured transaction environment inside the branch. Because the customers have already indicate what services needed and confirm the bank account and amount. Bank could automatically schedule the counter services accordingly and improve their process flow.